on that video i received a comment i don't know whether the comment was deleted by the person or it was not conforming with the norms hi guys welcome to a new video so today's video is basically not new it's a continuation to my previous video if you haven't checked that video out i will put it up here on the card or i will link it in the description box below so previous video i spoke about how to focus on hair regrowth by using all natural oils like coconut oil uh, castor oil olive oil these are nourishing oils they will hydrate your hair and boost your hair growth but i added a special ingredient that was the peppermint oil you can check the detailed video and um, like i said the link is up here and in the description bar below and without wasting any time if you are new to my channel don't forget to subscribe hit that notification bell so on that video i received a comment i don't know whether the comment was deleted by the person or it was not conforming with the norms of youtube that youtube deleted it i'm not so sure but that uh, comment got deleted but i did view the comment and the person said you should focus on speaking about shampoos that boost hairy growth now let's put two things aside hair growth boosting hair growth can be done only by using natural ingredients i firmly be believe that non adulterated natural ingredients and shampoos are designed or formulated just to cleanse your scalp it's not going to boost any form of hair growth i don't think so because i have not personally felt it i have tried biotin shampoos i didn't feel a difference i felt it was performing like any other shampoo i have even used the infamous mane and tail shampoo in, in indian rupees it is quite pricey i did purchase that i did try it it didn't work as much for me i still feel that uh, mane and tail perform like any other shampoo it is just for cleansing purposes if your scalp is clean so what i do is i do alternate days i wash my hair i try doing that once a week challenge of washing my hair doesn't work for me that way and uh, so basically before i wash my hair there is always a thorough oiling method i use peppermint oil i use peppermint oil in my oil mix and i massage my scalp after which i uh, thoroughly wash my hair using a mild shampoo so i use the himalaya protein gentle daily care shampoo now this shampoo also is controversial in many ways some people find it dries out the hair but it works just fine for me you know it just gives my hair that extra wava boom volume so i don't really have any bad comments to give on the himalaya gentle daily care uh, shampoo mainly because it's cost effective it's uh, easy on the uh, pockets so i have no complaints regarding that whatever shampoo suits you you use it my whole point of making this video is to burst the myth that shampoo is going to help you with your hair growth hair growth all the factors that determine hair growth are your nutrition exercise and most importantly you want your blood circulation the blood flow to be proper on your scalp if the blood flow is proper hair will grow faster and uh, hair growth uh, differs from person to person you know some people have excrete a lot of sebum on their scalp and so that can uh, you know moisturize the scalp and attract a lot of build up so there are people who wash their hair frequently and they do need a dermatologist help from a dermatologist to you know identify the root cause and the problem i was facing a lot of dandruff but ever since i have started using peppermint oil in my oil mix it has helped quite a lot with uh, my overall scalp health and hair growth even. so personally it's according to me and what how i feel shampoos do not boost hair growth they are just basically to clean your scalp if your scalp is clean there's no gunk your hair follicle can shoot out very easily and you know the growth process is not um, hampered or tempered whatever there's no problem there, there will be least breakage if your scalp is clean so that is all for this video i'm sorry my cat tintin has been hopping in to see the lights and the camera because i'm doing this after quite some time and she has seen the setup before but she's finding it something new each time i put her down she comes up so 
coming back to this video the whole point is you know have a good diet most importantly have a clean diet you know have your proteins have your vitamins vitamin e vitamin c um, vitamin b12 omega 3 fatty acids these are like important nutritional facts for your hair growth you know these pointers these uh, nutritional elements in your diet can improve your hair growth quite a lot hormones need to be balanced out have all clean eating habits cut down on junk i know sometimes there are temptations we have the urge of eating something delicious yummy a great hamburger or um, you know chips dips it's fine you can make your chips and dips at home too don't go for junks packaged uh, preservative foods you know that have preservatives that uh, you know have a shelf life and all that sort of thing make fresh food at home have your salads have your greens have uh, good uh, fatty acids some fatty acids are important some fat intake is important so all these factors de determine hair growth according to me shampoos cannot grow your hair they are only for the purpose of cleaning your scalp oil your hair as frequently as you can preferably if you don't like oiling do it once a week at least your hair deserves that kind of pampering and treatment uh, if uh, you have a natural hair mask to make do that you know hair also requires hydration i'm going to end this video okay because there are people wanting to come in and i cannot be blabbing quite a bit so that's all for this video if you like this video hit the like button i will be making a video soon i wanted to make a lingerie haul because i have purchased quite a lot of braziers to wear bras braziers whatever you want to call it so i want to make that haul so that haul will be lined up soon that's all for this video if you like this video hit the like button don't feel to subscribe give your thoughts over this video in the comment section below until then bye